you requested it, they get great reviews. Let's talk about them. Hello and welcome to Trucking Answers. I'm Mark, your humble host of the best trucking channel on YouTube. I said it. That's right, I said it. All right. By request this week, we have a company who you can't hardly find a bad word said about them, even though they've been open a long time. And that really says something about a company and it should make you consider them strongly just from that. Let's talk about Schuster this week. All right. So by request, people have asked about it. All right. So look, Schuster, they've been open for a long time. They do a lot of refrigerated uh, ice cream hauls. All right. So expect to run heavy, which is good in the wintertime. Expect the reefer to have to run a lot. You're going to get extra points uh, at when you fill up because you're going to be filling that reefer all the time at when you're running 20 below, constant run on there. All right. But uh, look, that's not a bad thing. I'm just saying, expect a lot of uh, ice cream. They're from the home of ice cream in Iowa. You can't find a bad word said about them hardly online, which is really, really impressive. There's always going to be a few detractors, uh, no matter what. But this place, they ha and plus they have a less than 40% turnover rate. What does that tell you? If people are not quitting a place that's over the road and some places have 200%, that says something as well all right so you can start there depending on experience and they'll take you with little to no experience at 21 years old all right so don't think about that up to 53 cents now that does include a five cent bonus that pretty much everybody gets there so 48 cents plus bonus they also have a quarterly bonus to add to that up to three more cents so you know you're up in the mid 50s to start right away all right so look they have a 50 dollars bonus to go to east coast which they can keep it nobody wants it keep the bonus i don't want your 50 bucks you say we well, don't want to go there look they have a no-go area so when you start there you tell them look this area of the country i don't want to go you can actually pick a part of the country that's a no-go for you and you don't have to go there <laughs> that's really something and uh, they have a non-coerced uh, dispatch let's put it like that it's not no non-forced but if you were just up late and you're super tired or whatever, they will work with you. And I've read tons of people that say that this works. They do it. Okay, so that you don't have to just, oh, I'm, I'm tired or whatever. They'll work with you on stuff like that. That's unusual, believe me. Also, no forced routing. So like a lot of places, you must follow this route. They don't have that. Of course, look, let's be reasonable. You cannot pick up in Los Angeles and, you know, go through, uh, you know, Oregon to go to Miami. That's not going to work. But if there's a better route that you can take, you get to take it and they don't give you a lot of grief about it. They expect you to come in, do your job, deliver your ice cream or whatever it is and uh, you know, not bother them and then they won't bother you. I love that kind of stuff. I love it. Now they have a wellness program, which I think is interesting. Most companies uh, don't care about your wellness, really. They say it, but they don't. So here, right, you get a free yearly biometric screening. You get a free uh, health coaching call. So you get to call in and they'll talk to you. But hey, fatty, why don't you lose some weight or whatever? They probably don't call you fatty. Uh, they have, you can go to the YMCA free when you're there in town. Uh, you have an, a free on-site fitness center as well. They even have fresh fruit there. I mean, at our safety meetings where I work, okay, they we had one where they talked about about driver health which I thought was hilarious and in the back it's catered and they bring all this food and it's got all this uh, s s um, scrambled eggs with bacon it's got it had a pile of bacon the mountain of bacon it had mountains of sausage mountain of links it had all donuts all kinds of pastries and stuff. hilarious and it was all about health so this place is actually doing something about health by providing fresh fruit you know doing all these other things it matters all right we don't want to die early we don't we don't want to do that so Look, that kind of stuff matters. Now, reefers, look, reefers run 24 hours a day. You might have to run 24 hours a day. They're, you're going to deliver in the middle of the night. You're going to deliver during the day. It's just how reefers are. But you always get longer loads. I always like that. They're talking 2,500 to 3,000 miles a week over the road. You are out 10 to 21 days. You have to accept that when you go in there. Everything is a trade-off. So if you say, I can't be out that long, it might not be the place for you, even though it gets good reviews. Don't uh, think that, oh, well, you know, maybe they'll work with me. That's what they're saying up front. So be ready for it. If you're not ready for it, don't apply there and then gripe about it. Okay. So when they're being upfront about this stuff, don't say, well, I can't sell three weeks. They're saying that you might be out three weeks. So look, they also have cars at the terminal. So when you go to the terminal, they got a car sitting there, a couple cars actually it says, and you get to go and take it to go do your running around or whatever like that. No driver facing cameras. All right, will they come? I don't know. Right now, no cameras. 
finally, right? They have forward-facing cameras. Apparently, some of the trucks have them. Okay, so the APUs and tri-packs got all that. We're going to go with that. You can also have a three-prong outlet installed in there if you want to cook stuff in a hot plate. Come to orientation. They're going to give you your own room, all right? And they're going to feed you three meals a day. One's at the motel, and then they give you a couple more meals. Look, the truck speed 65, but it can increase if you get better fuel mods. So if you reduce your idling, turn it off right away in that, it can increase up to 70 miles an hour. And the president there drives. It's a driver, all right? So I assume when he gets old and his kids take over, the place will go down the crapper. But for as most places. But right now, I don't think so, right? Doing good over that place. So look, uh, are these a problem? Some of them, maybe. You know, $40 a stop, $150 to cross the border. They run 48 states and Canada. You'd think Canada wouldn't need reefers. Can't they just leave the ice cream sitting outside? I don't know. I went to public school. I don't know anything. The problem here, right, in, oh, well, they also have longevity bonuses. Okay, so the only problem, right, is this day and night stuff. If you can do that, pass the DOT physical, might be the place for you. Nice trucks, turn them in at 450 or so. Deer guards on most of them look pretty good. So look, is it, uh, you know, is it the greatest place ever? Maybe, maybe you'll have to consider it. Okay, so call them up, give them a call. I have their information in the description. See if it, uh, you know, ask your doctor if it's, if a Schuster is right for you. They're doing a lot of things better than a lot of places, all right? So let's uh, let's just th keep that stuff in mind. When you can go online at a company that's got a five-digit DOT number and you can't find hardly anything bad said about them, that says something about the company because now it is so easy for people to post and people just aren't posting bad things. They're getting four in the high, mid to high fours on Indeed and all Glassdoor and all these places. That is really, really good compared to some places there are no twos. So, uh, all right, so think about it. Consider it, somebody wanted this Schuster out there. Yeah, uh, I'm in, we'll put it down as another good reefer company out there. And uh, that's about it, all right? Remember, I do a live show every Monday at 1 p.m. Eastern. Be there on the show. About to have the big 20,000 subscriber giveaway. Tons of stuff coming in for that. Be on that show. We'll talk to you soon with more Trucking Answers.